Hello everybody, now we will set up the reference inside our fields and in this video we will talk about the Firestore uh, reference. So in Firestore one of the biggest advantages, one of the, of the biggest updates is that uh, one document can link to another, one element can be a reference to another document inside our database. So let's see this, this is our restaurant menu and this document in this field links to another document and this is the restaurant collection. So this in fact an item belongs to a collection inside the menu. So this is set up manually but what we will want to do is from our admin to be able to select the collection of this product and what we want to display here is a list of uh, categories that we have, a list of collections that we have so we want to display this list it will show up shortly so we want to display breakfast, coffee, dessert, wine, vegetarian, dinner and so we can say that this field belongs to that element and in Firestore this is supported natively so what you have to do is define the, when you add a field it should be a reference you should give it a name okay in this in our case is collection so what we're going to do is inside our app.js in the relation file type define that collection should be represented as a relationship as a drop down okay this is the first step and in the second step we need to define this uh, relation here so these are the options for relation what you will get when you download the code you will get two examples like this one this is one the first one is for firebase and the second one is for firestore and for Firestore we need to copy this one, although they are the same. Okay, so step one, uh, the display. What we should display is we want to display the name of the category. So we want to display the title. And in our database the title is inside restaurant collection and each document the name is title. So we will use for that field title. Use value pet is in fact by default to true for Firestore. I'll put on the bottom. Key is the key that we want to use. So this is the collection. So this reference for this element that will belong to this collection but this is the path for where we want to to get the values and in, in for this example our path is just restaurant collection I'll copy that here it is restaurant collection produce relationship key this is for also for firebase because in Firebase, uh, real-time database, in the old database, there was no relationship. Relationship joiner is also for Firebase. Relationship key also. And one, the one left is the value. So what will be the value that will be displayed uh, there? and this is also for firebase in firestore directly it uses the path to the to the reference so what in fact it should be set it up is the, the display which field we want to display the key where we want to display it on for collection okay and from where we should get the the date this is from restaurant collection okay that's great and these fields you can when it's firestore they're not taken into account okay 
and when I save it, when I go to when I want to edit a menu item, it's slow because I'm uploading a video. Okay, so my new product and for collection I want to be able to select some of the the values there so I want to select breakfast and this will be my breakfast one so I say that this product belong to the breakfast collection or category and that's it it's saved so the next time I open this product by default will be selected it will be from that collection. Now take the data from the database. I can move it to the certs. Okay, so that is how easy it is to set it up the collection for the references for uh, for Firestore so only these three fields are taken into account and for advanced usage you can also work on this one but you will need also some code modification that's why they are not removed so you need to set the display what you want to display in the drop-down the key for what key we want to display this relationship so this is the collection key and path from where to get the data and we will have a fully functional Firestore native uh, relationships thanks for watching